A recent survey found that average salaries at U.S. companies have risen by less than 2% so far this year. That's the smallest increase in more than 30 years. In these t tough times, people may be afraid to ask for raises, but Jill Schlesinger, editor-at-large for CBSMoneyWatch.com, says it's all in how you do it. Good morning. Good morning. This sounds like the fool's errand to end all fool's errands. I mean, really, seriously, going in and asking a boss for a raise in these days, day and times? I know it sounds crazy, but, and it's true, base salaries have stagnated. But the variable compensation that adds in bonuses, profit sharing options, that's actually increased to a larger part of your total compensation. So there could be ways to beef up your okay. compensation. Serious question, though. We were looking at phenomenal unemployment levels, hundreds of thousands of new people going into the unemployment lines every month, and in this atmosphere, I would be a afraid to even broach the subject. You have got to find the eye of the tiger, my friend. Is that right? Because you bring something to your organization and your boss needs you. Okay. That's the deal. All right. So let's, let's go through how to exactly do this. And your first piece of advice is what? Talk face to face with your boss. You know, I can't stand when people say, oh, I emailed my boss. You emailed your boss? It's like breaking up on a post-it note. Don't do that. <laughs> you got to present your list of accomplishments. Keep that spreadsheet handy mm -hmm. and focus Focus on the money you have saved or made for the company and the additional responsibilities you have assumed since the recession began. Because of these other downsizes and everything else, you're doing all these other people's jobs. I'm this much more valuable to you. You are critical to this organization, and here's why, boss. Okay, what other pieces of advice in this process do we need to be paying attention to? Well, you know, when you're thinking about this, think about also other ways to get your compensation, right? Okay. So you may want to say, hey, what about if I could get maybe a negotiated future raise? I'm not going to give you anything now, your boss says. You say, okay, how about in six months? Okay, no, boss says no way. Mm -hmm. Then set a date for your next discussion. Set specific goals that you can achieve. That will help you out. Very important, the specific goal right. part. Now, this eye of the tiger thing. <laughs> I know I'm very serious about this because you have to play this with a certain amount of finesse. Right. If you're in there as the as the squeaky wheel, sometimes the squeaky wheel gets grease. Sometimes the squeaky wheel gets kicked off. And if your boss says, you know, we cannot give you money, right. there are other things that you can get. And that's really important because you say, all right, no money. How about some other kinds of compensation, mm. some more vacation? How about you pay for my education? Get me a better title. How about I get actually a nicer office, make my quality of life <laughs> at work pretty much is stinky now. Maybe it gets better. There these things do matter, and you do have to go in believing in yourself. All right, so all of these things are the things you ought to do. What should you absolutely not do? Well, we are in a recession. I think you've heard that. Right. So don't go in all cocky, and don't use the rules of the past, the bull markets. Don't threaten to leave, because no one's leaving, really. Don't <laughs> flaunt your other offer. Harry says to his boss, oh, I have an offer from another network. Well, right. you know what? Maybe that's not the greatest idea. And don't talk about how hard you work. Everybody is working hard. They all know you're working hard. Go in there, be confident, and be clear about what you need and why you deserve it. Can we just set up like a 1-800 number so all the viewers can call you and kind of get this pep talk? Baby, I'm here for you. And when you go your next contract, I'll do it with you. <laughs> I'll coach your, your manager. There you okay? go. Very good, Jill. Thank you very, very much. For more career advice, go to our web partner, cbsmoneywatch.com.